The biggest concern that we have with a patient presenting with an acute onset or a new onset of floaters would be something like a retinal tear or a detachment. You know, if a patient, and that can happen to anybody really at any time for any reason, but a trauma to the eye, unfortunately, sports, they get hit in the eye, say baseball, something like that, cause a rupture or a tear in the retina. That can cause shearing forces in the retina and a specific layer of the retina that can then, you know, throw pigment into the vitreous, for instance, that patients can see as floaters, blood. You know, if you, if you get a break in any of the blood vessels or the tissue itself, you can get floaters formed from that. And even patients that are diabetic, you know, whether that be a type 1 or a type 2 diabetic, depending on how well they're controlled and how long they've been diabetic, they can have, you know, unfortunate situations like a vitreous hemorrhage that can then lead to large floaters or even a shower of floaters present in their vision suddenly. So it's not always age-related, and that's why we do want to check it. But certainly, yeah, there are acute things that can occur with that, too. 